Hello everybody to cope up with the fast paced world what is the most important thing that you would focus upon for your customers to provide technological solutions definitely your customers will be delighted if the deployments are effortless and super quick so today i will take you through towards pre-built templates by AWS that helps you deploy popular stacks on AWS. They equip you with gold standard deployments in an automated fashion that accelerates your complex and cumbersome procedures into just few steps. Citrix has collaborated with AWS to provide modular, customizable and rapid solutions. Currently, we have two solutions available on AWS in Quick Start section that takes into consideration AWS best practices. This demo will be mainly focused on deployment of Citrix ADC VPX for web applications, which is our all-in-one application delivery controller. If you want to deploy your ADCs in HA mode across availability zones, this is your solution. It is intended for users who want to build and test a POC or to create a production ready solution. This quick start has three sections that caters to what, how and costing of Citrix ADC solution. Let's understand the architecture of the deployment. Here we have a VPC that spans across two availability zones with one public subnet and two private subnets in each of the availability zones. Two Citrix ADC instances, one is primary and other being secondary, which are deployed in active passive mode. These instances are accessible only through a Linux Bastion host to have an extended layer of security. Further, three security groups that acts as firewall to control the traffic for their associated instances. One thing to note here is we haven't configured backend servers in this deployment, but we have set the stage for you to configure your apps. Let us proceed towards the cost and licensing section. The cost will depend on the Citrix AMI image you choose based on licensing, throughput and bundling options. Now let's move to the deployment guide that states details on how to deploy. You can go through the comprehensive solution guide which will enable you with step-by-step -step instructions on why, what and how of this deployment and also the customization process. You can also go through the architecture, deployment options and the technical requirements. If you are well aware on the configuration details, directly jump to step 3 and launch the quick start, where you have two options whether to deploy into a new VPC or an existing VPC, which is the workload template. Make sure to follow the tips to have a seamless deployment. Here we launch the CFT by clicking on the deploy button to deploy our solution into a fresh new VPC. You have four simple steps to configure your stack that requires you to fill in the region, availability zones, VPC, CIDR, Bastion hosts, etc. Make sure you have configured Citrix ADC AMI image from your AWS marketplace before launching the CFT. If you leave this field blank, the BYOL AMI image will be auto-populated. For any queries and details on what value to put in, you could refer the guide. For simplicity, I have put in all the default values and post that click on create stack. Now your deployment of Citrix ADC HA pair across availability zones will begin. After the deployment is complete, validate the EC2 instances running in AWS console. Here we can see primary and secondary instances and a bastion host. Currently, Elastic IP is associated with primary instances and this floats to secondary upon failover. The deployment guide has sections such as how to test the deployment, what best practices to follow or FAQs, to post feedback, submit feature ideas or report bugs, use the issues section of the GitHub repository. Henceforth, Citrix ADC's collaboration with AWS to build this quick start using AWS best practices ensures top-notch security and high availability for applications and that too with minimalistic efforts and time. Thank you.